lose him. He's the man that they look to when they do need a goal. For the referee, that's uh, booking because he saw that offence. No, he didn't want to stop playing. And we think we're all agreed, Alan, aren't we, that that's the way to do it. Yeah, yeah. I think he's one of my favourite refs. I think he's one of the more experienced ones. And uh, he really gives the game a chance. The interceptor has got the ball here. Offside, referee has stopped the play as soon as the flag went up. Made sure the ball is stuck at his foot. Good control here, quite congested midfield, but good passing from this team. Could be dangerous. Wanted the ball and got it. Ian Robin. ball here Nestor Vidrio Israel Castro sliding challenge coming in he's got out of the way of it Ian Robert got the tackle in turnover for possession here Been a crunching tackle if he'd felt it, but he got out of the way of it. Goal kick here. Israel Castro. Omar Bravo. He'll get some help from this player making a run. Player slid in at him. Somehow he got out of the way. There's some potential in this move. Robin Van Persie. It's back, it's their ball again. For a good intercepting play. That teammate's made himself available with decent movement here. Robin Van Persie. Israel Castro. Saved the defending team by that offside flag. They think it was on, but when they look at the replays after this match, they'll realise the official made a good call there. That's why goalkeepers have to be strong to deal with shots of that power. He knew exactly where he wanted to head that. That's where you want to try and get control in midfield, and they've got the ball. He's avoided that sliding challenge. Nimble footwork from the player there as the opponent came in on the slide. Well, the ball's gone out for a goal kick. Into the attacking third. It's not really going to get the better of him from that range, especially when he can see it all the way. Nice back heel then. Position changes feet. That's very well read, and that's a very good interception. On the move here, he's a teammate of his. He's got good support from a teammate, good movement. That could be a booking here. Nestor Vidrio. done to win the ball back like that with a slight tackle it's a good run off the ball well they're in a good position here and here's the shot surely oh clean in at the goalkeeper 
goalkeeper just couldn't get it on target. Well, he's on his own there, and he's done all the spade work himself, just couldn't produce the finish. to do something a bit too clever, I think, and an interception was made. Very safe goalkeeping to make the stop and keep hold of the ball. They've got the ball back through a very good interception. Oh, there's a good one. That will be a free kick. I think so, and it was a poor tackle, it was badly timed. Omar Bravo. Fantastic slide tackle to get the ball. Well, we could get some news on the injury. I think Jeff Shrees is on the case. Physio's up on the touchline, keeping an eye on him, because he went over on his ankle. It looks like he's going to be OK. Thanks very much, Jeff. Well, he's up on his feet, Alan. I think he'll be back. Yeah, and the sooner the ref waves him on, the better. You can never understand the delay with these things. Referee does blow, the flag was up from the assistant. It's where you want to try and get control in midfield, and they've got the ball. Well, the injury wasn't terminal for this match for the player, delighted to say, and he's not a decisive save. Stop the attack, that. Here's Van Persie. Flag went up straight away, referee blew offside. He's given the offside and he couldn't miss that one, could he? Well, this is what Dutch football really is all about and we haven't seen perhaps enough of it. Certainly, the Holland players have felt that they've given of their best in recent times, but they played really well here and the victory that they thoroughly deserve will be confirmed very shortly. Negris. Here he is with a chance. Oh! And it's a block away by the defender. Just five minutes to go. To... Could be a yellow card here for that foul. Well, that's uh, good defensive positioning, really, for the defender to deal with the cross. Field area. Here's the cross, and the ball in is dealt with well by the defender. time to get what they want here would have been a crunching tackle if he'd felt it but he got out of the way of it here's a chance to attack here's the yacht could have got hurt in that incident but he jumped out of the way of the sliding tackle more possibility maybe to get this crucial goal close range chance oh, oh and they're level they've done it late in the game Got it back level, and there is still time.
time to go for the win. I wonder whether they'll go for it or just settle for the draw. Oh, what a win it would be, but a draw would be a fantastic result. Well, this team just will not lie down. Got the reward here. No equal. Maybe they can get a winner. And it is now 2-2. Two -two. Dangerous moment. And here's the teammates on the move here. Israel Castro. Guadalajara attacking. Maybe running out of time. Still trying to win. Got him in with a chance. Strong hands from the goalkeeper to keep out a shot of that power. And Guadalajara had the corner. And a chance to take the lead. Well, it was an easy clearance from the corner. They could attack from this, actually. It was down to the referee to stop the play, and he's done that. And the referee's just dropped the ball. And they're going to give it back to the other team after that substitution. Well, it's an enforced substitution. There's no doubt it's because of that injury. Well, there's some etiquette to be observed here at the drop ball after the injured player has gone off. Rodriguez. Good, strong tackle. And now can he score? Robert! to me, they look fit and they, they've settled into a system that they look comfortable with. So it's full time with the final score, 3-2. I'll leave you with the full match highlights and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling. See you then.